and now I'm going to give the commentaries regarding about this case. Okay, in this case that we know that the object in dispute is actually a huge printing machine which is actually attached to the land with nuts and bolts. So according to the case of Horner and Hoxton, actually two, two tests actually will be used to determine whether it is a fixture or not, which is actually the degree of annexation and object of annexation and the onus of proving it actually falls on the first objector as the printing machine was considered to be attached to the land. Okay, so however, in this case, the first objector actually failed okay, to, dis to elaborate on the object of annexations as according to the case of Reid versus Smith, okay, it was held that if the object itself or the article itself is not for the better enjoyment of the land but rather is for the, it's for the enjoyment of the article itself, then it should not be considered as a fixture, it should be considered as a chattel. In this case, a printing machine should be considered as a, ch a chattel because it is not to be used for the better enjoyment of the land but for the better for the better usage of the article itself it could be argued but the first objector has the onus of proving it and in this case he has failed to prove it so therefore i agree with the judgment given by the judge because the first objector has the onus of proving it and he failed to prove it therefore he did the right decision to give the uh printing machine back to mimb that's the commentary for me thank you very much